The Igbos will not know peace until they draw agitations for Biafra, Adamu Garaba said. On his Facebook page, he added, Those who are disturbing the peace of the nation will never see the light of the day. I beg, I follow and say amen to that prayer. Because we know the people when they disturb the peace of this country. Then they talk, say, something day your eyes, you never feel removed. Man. You can't tell your brother and say, see what day your eyes remove. Man. You don't feel face speak to one when they your eyes. Do not announce they are very quick in judging the, the southerners. But they have issues in the north. I wonder how someone will be carrying elephants on his head and you are using your leg to pick cricket. I don't think agitators is the problem of this country, but the federal government and the northern as they are. Starting from the love they are showing Bandit and Boko Haram in this country, Bandit and Boko Haram, they are their favorites. To the extent that the government, the federal government, can, oh, the president of Nigeria said, they cannot directly confront Bandit in the country. So that means, the fight of insecurity in Nigeria is not going to be, you know, an history because we don't know when it's going to end. Since the federal government is telling us that they don't have the capacity to face bandits and Boko Haram. Come on. Yes, somebody is telling us that Igbos are the problem of Nigeria. He said that because they are agitating and at the same time asking for presidency come 2023 and if i may ask is it wrong if they asked these are the people since the beginning of democracy in nigeria they have not been there but they have been supporting every other regions now they are glamouring to become at least for them to you know get the slots they want to crucify them okay you don't want to give them uh, presidency, you don't still want them to go. You are crucifying agitators and all that. You see all these things, the government, they, they are talking here and this and that. All these things is just to blackmail, uh, uh, blackmail IPOV members. What we have in the South is, is government or non gunmen because I see no reason why all these people till now, they have not been known if anything happens, the next thing you will hear, IPOP stroke ESN. But they are forgotten that. IPOP have the bank being behind the unknown gunmen. Even the sit at home today in the Southeast, did they not ask Indigo to go to their, their normal activities, to resume their normal activities every Sunday, every Monday? So who are those people who are asking people to continue to sit at home? Nigerian government self, no, they even they go that way. Adamu Garaba is always on Igbos. I don't know why, but all this is just hatred. They let them go. But I love his prayer, he said. Let me take it again. He said, those who are disturbing the peace of the nation will not see the light of the day. We know those who are disturbing the peace of the nation. If the government of the day actually did the needful, do you think the agitation, you know, we escalate to this level because they failed to, you know, approach the issue amicably? This is a very sensitive matter. You cannot just start killing people and you want them, you know, to, to stop agitating. It's not possible. They are all now be saying, now here we go die put. If you won't kill us, kill us, finish. Now here we go die put. The government should do the need for the method, the approach they are using, you know, on agitations is not going to solve the problem of agitation in Nigeria. The method and their approach on bandit and Boko Haram is not going to stop banditry and Boko Haram terrorizing the country in Nigeria. But they are giving them the most strength to carry out their 
you know, their evil activities. People will kill. People who destroy properties of people who have dis displaced millions of northerners. The northerners are not seeing those people as the enemy of the country. No, just because they are Muslims. They are uh, uh, northerners. So for that, they, ha they have not committed any sin. So what are we not talk talking about? Is that not the same tribalistic issue, tribalism? That the country, the government is just facing one side. You know, good. Do to me the way you do, my brothers. Then I said, then they talk. Um, if you want peace to reign, I don't see the Igbos as the problem of this country. Because the Northerners, they are drawing us back, honestly. They are drawing us back. So saying that the Igbos are the problem of this country, I don't think is right. Anyway, Nigerians who are, have reacted, let's hear what they have to say. The first person said here, I do not blame anybody, but I blame the British colonial that emerged us with these people. We don't supposed to be together in one country. Okay, someone just dropped that. Another person said, Adamu Garaba, I don't know what you saw on Igbo people that you continue to be attacking us, saying that we don't know peace and all that. May God take away peace from you. Oh, okay, someone said that. Another person said, I don't want to say too much here yeah, because it's very glary right now. Those who are who are defending these people can now say that they are the one who want to finish us because of their agenda. Okay, these are some reactions by Nigerians. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts with us below the comment section. Thank you very much.